Hello and welcome to Rose Low Gaming and today we will talk a little bit about how we got to 300 subscribers. So if you want to know more and check out how you can get to that number yourself if you are into the gaming community or the gaming niche so to say and wanting to do YouTube videos stay around and check this video out. Will be some pro tips on how I got there myself. So here are the three topics we will discuss today in this video or I'll talk about. So make sure you stay tuned to the end to see every small tips and everything like that. Before we get into the video, remember to smash that like button if you enjoy this content and this channel. It's very much appreciated. And if you have any questions or thoughts about the topics that I'm going to discuss here today, do leave a comment or anything like that and I will reply of course and the most positive and informative comment will also get pinned, yes you know. And if you haven't hit subscribe yet, do that so you don't miss content like this uh, because I will do updates on these types of videos once I reach different milestones. So I have done one for 100, I'm doing one for 300 now and I will do probably for 500 and 1000 subscribers and also of course so you don't miss out on any of our gaming episodes let's play episodes on our very special nice channel anyway with all of that said a little bit long but uh, come on guys you know what's it what's it all about uh, we'll talk about different subjects here so content is really king for uh, gaming niche channels since every time you upload a video get higher and higher chances that someone will see it really especially if you're doing a let's play uh, with several episodes in the same series because each time someone saw the first episode they will likely be recommended at some point to see the second episode so if a person clicked the first episode there is a high chance that they will click the second episode and that will turn into a sort of snowball effect uh, sooner or later and in the beginning it's very small uh, and it takes time but if you are consistent with your content and upload on a consistent schedule it will help very very much to get noticed and to get the ball to start to roll. Uh, I myself have in the beginning had a lot of time on my hands so started out quite small with just doing trying to do one video per day i know it's not small for most guys but for me it was quite small uh, when i had the time and then i noticed that i could ramp it up to do two videos per day like many of the youtubers that i watch that are in the gaming niche are doing they are doing at least two videos per day so i started doing that and i did that as long as i could and that meant that I could get my hands in on more games and starting more Let's Play series and having a bigger chance of getting that snowball effect. So that is really a pro tip that I can give you. Try to upload as much as possible and consistently. But also the key here is really that the content is good and that you are knowing your audience and what you are trying to do. So here at Rothko Gaming we are trying to take a slower approach to the games than there is on most gaming channels. Most gaming channels are very hard edited in uh, in today's format, at least for Fortnite and games like that, where you only see the good parts and, and not the slow parts, so, so to say. If you want to see the slow parts and everything, you really go to Twitch uh, nowadays. And I don't really want to go to Twitch and I think that there is an audience for that as well that don't want to go to Twitch and want to see other sort of content so that's really what we're trying to do here so know your niche and know what you, uh, your audience is looking for and try to stay true to that and also most importantly actually have fun while you're doing your content it will show in your videos and uh, will show through really and that will get people to like you and want to watch your channel so make sure that you enjoy what you're doing if you're not enjoying it don't do it it's really better that way so try to be just yourself and as good as possible and have fun and be consistent and bring out as much content content as you possibly can and you will be on a good start 
Second thing here that we want to talk about is SEO, as you see here. So YouTube is really an extension of Google. So it's basically a big search engine for, but for videos. And for that, you can have several different tools to help you. And of course, you need to know as well a little bit about search engine optimization, which SEO stands for. So basically, it means that you need to have good titles and good uh, descriptions and things like that and you have different tools that can help you so here you have the VidIQ basic that can help you or TubeBuddy they are both uh, here I have the search here for SimGolf and you can see some stats on helping uh, regarding that and VidIQ basic looks like this and basically free version so I'm, I myself are using TubeBuddy uh, which I think works better and this looks like this and uh, both are very similar here and sim golf is uh, one of the series that i've been doing so actually here uh, also when you search uh, it's always based on your own preference so my own videos will be a little bit higher up than they are actually are uh, but i believe my video here for sim golf are placed around maybe 15 16 uh, between 15 and 20 for my first episode, so it's here. I can't be bothered to count here uh, if it's higher than it should be. But anyway, it's here, and here I've tried to utilize many things uh, for search engine optimization. So I've just searched for Sim Golf here, so it's just a part of the title. Sit my here, Sim Golf is the actual full title, uh, but I Make sure that it's only in the title and it's in the title, that's very important. And the same thing in the description, that it's only in the description and in it. It needs to be before the cut at least and uh, preferably in the first few words. So I've done that and as you see, uh, placed all right here if you search for sim golf, but uh, there are others that have been doing very much better. Uh, but that depends, of course, of uh, how many subscribers they have and so on. Like this one, Simon Monkey here has 372 subscribers, but he got 9.1k views on his video. Albeit it's five years old, but I think he has uh, a pretty in interesting thumbnail here, which we will get onto later uh, and talk about. So you can try to utilize. Uh, the information as much as possible and for just search engine optimization so you can have a keyword the keyword here is sim golf so both tubebuddy and vidiq you can have search explorer here you have tubebuddy which will help you know if it's a good keyword or not so here you have low competition but also very low volume uh, which is not too good and you can have here, it's unweighted, but you can also click for a weighted uh, score, which will take into consideration how big your channel is. And also here, if you click it, you will get a little bit more information. And uh, here for key, uh, for TubeBuddy, I got uh, a bigger package and I'll, I'll leave links in the description and everything like that for you to check it out. Uh, I highly recommend TubeBuddy. It helps me every day making good decisions for the channel. But anyway, weighted, you can see here, uh, it's lower. It's 19 out of 100, but here it also takes consideration um, of how many views per video as an average you get for your channel. So mine is actually only seven. Uh, it's probably going higher and higher up now when we are developing and get, getting more subs in and things like that. Uh, and here you see the lowest video view count found in top ranking videos is 57 and the average is 2.1k. So here I should realistically have maybe a decent chance in actually getting a good placement if I can do good <laughs> engine optimization from the start so it can rank up high at the start because once you release the video it always start as high as possible more or less and then it drops down with time depending on how many clicks and things you get. Uh, so basically here it says it's quite quite a poor keyword for me but even though it's quite poor I've managed to rank it inside top 20. Uh, so I think yeah I own one of 30 
uh, search results I'm in the top 30 and here also if you clicking the keyword explorer you can get video search uh, searches uh, that are starting with same goal for uh, suggesting that could be better so if for example if you would press sim golf windows 10 uh, it goes up to 44 so that's a better keyword if we go up to sim golf 10 download is up to 45 so it's better but not much and here we can also click on the most used tags here so sim my sim golf video game that's a very poor tag actually or keyword since it's only at 17 here and you can also check the verb searches and video topics so you have all these different tools to uh, get a good keyword into your video and the, the title and the description so do check this out so you have the best and here you also can see trending queries that are related to uh, to the search term so if for example we search for only sim golf i think it's this is still too low yeah exactly it's too low traffic or search volume to show anything here but here you can have find good examples so i'm also doing football manager so let's actually search that oh sure just for you to see so if i press trending here we will see some uh, trending queries here so football manager 2019 and download is on breakout and yeah uh, you see that it's a lot of, uh, of from download and free and apk which are from mobile and review and all these different stuff that are arising related queries and uh, top related queries is of course football manager 2019 and 2018 also very much uh, so here you can as i said find so many keywords uh, which are key in getting a good placement in the search result and here is where you want to build up your channel getting a good uh, search placement and then you can build momentum of getting more and more and people see your first episode and then they will get a chance to see the second episode uh, so I think it's really key and really good and a great tool and let's talk about the last top care sums are something that is very important as well getting the audience to click just your thumbnail so here, for example here in Sid Myers in Golf you have most of the thumbnails are just from gameplay uh, straight from uh, from the game and you have people that have put in the logo like I have done here on my video and I've put the uh, retro gaming 101 over it and uh, then you have some that are no logo over it and, and nothing special at all and uh, then you have uh, some with with an extra dude <laughs> on it or something and here you have themselves in the video I guess and the cover for sim golf and here from the menu and here you have one of the top ranking videos uh, at some line that are actually something totally else but it just looks very nice actually at least I think so I'm a little bit not sad but I think I, I could have uh, taken inspiration from uh, this thumbnail here uh, from killed rob place that are something very much else here in the Sid Meier's sim golf result if you search for sim golf uh, that are as I said something very different and makes you want to click it more than the other videos maybe yeah that's really that's really it actually i would say on how to work yourself up to 300 subs and more just try and bring good content do your keyword research with uh, the tools that are in tubebuddy or with iq and make a great thumb that makes people want to click your video as you grow your content and <laughs> not your content but as you grow your channel and also actually your content you will get more and more of a snowball effect and get more of a following and get easier to get gain views and subscribers just, just get in there and get going is really the best best tip i can give you uh, actually so with that said remember to smash that, that like button if you have enjoyed this 
video here and also hit the subscribe button if you want to see more like this and also my let's play series of course thank you very much for watching and i'll be back later when we hit 500 subs bye bye